I'm Super Saiyan, and I'm my name is Sarah, and I'm from Canada, Ontario, and you're watching the Alley H. Is that silver? It legit looks like silver. Is that silver? What up, guys? I'm Mozart. Wait, you're not, Mo you. you're not Mozart. G. What's going on, guys? <laughs> Today we're gonna be doing a challenge where we're gonna find this abandoned cave. We're in this enormous forest. Like this place goes on forever. I'm with Mo Sarji. And man, it's gonna get intense because do, do you know about the cave? Nope. So it's a witch's cave. Supposedly she used to go there when they ran her out of the town and that's where she used to stay. Okay. This is so I kind of withheld that part from Mo because uh, we just had that thing with Tom and it's things have not been going our way lately yeah but <laughs> this is gonna be fun this place is absolutely beautiful well that's more beautiful oh, thank you baby I appreciate <laughs> it so guys get ready don't forget to follow me on snapchat Instagram and Twitter so you guys can get behind the scenes footage of what we're doing right now don't forget to check out Mo Sarchi he's filming here with me as well so am I is or am he? I the one that's gonna be killing you and burying your body in this forest is that why you brought the machete? Yep. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Alright guys, stay tuned, it's gonna get hype. Beautiful. Guys, check this place out. This place literally goes on for like miles. And it's just, it's just like literally right now because of the winter. It's like a big swamp. All that water there. So we gotta trek through that. We gotta trek through all these trees. These branches are hitting us in the face. But it's gonna be exciting and Mo just informed me that there's moose here and if you guys know about moose they're uh, pretty nasty sometimes but it's territorial yeah we'll fight you so we gotta go find the moose and piss on its rock so we <laughs> mark our territory for that moose I want you guys to hashtag say nation below hashtag banana squad hashtag what else flex squad I want you guys to hashtag flex squad hashtag whatever you want honestly just keep hashtagging whatever you guys want and let me know what else you guys want to see also guys, shout out to all of you that are following me on Instagram. We just reached 10k. So shout out to all you guys. For those of you who do follow me on Instagram, you guys know that I mostly post my fitness pictures on there and pictures of my cat and stuff like that. So to all of you that keep commenting, stop flexing on Instagram. Oh my god guys, look what we've been doing. We've been trekking through this. <laughs> There's a fucking pit. God damn it. See, so as I was saying, all you guys that keep commenting, Stop flexing. I'm gonna flex twice as hard just for you guys. Also guys, I'm gonna announce that I'm gonna be giving away a copy of Fallout 4 for Xbox One. Uh, to, get, to get into that contest, I need you guys to share this video on Facebook, follow me on Instagram, and follow me on Twitter, and take screenshots showing that you followed me and shared the video and send them to me through DM on Instagram or Twitter and you guys get entered to win a copy of Fallout 4 for Xbox One. Guys, for the record, I don't know if you guys recognize any of this, but this is the Witch's Forest. Rumor is, she moved into that cave when she got kicked out of the cabin. So, you know, we found her, we found her cabin before, we found that noose there, and when she was kicked out of there, apparently she used to live in this cave. So hopefully we can find it, but you guys can tell by how scary this place is. It just goes on forever. Like, it's essentially never ending. So guys, what we're looking for is a fence. Supposedly, this place is fenced off so nobody goes there anymore. So that's what we're looking for. So hopefully we can find it. I also want to say, I love you guys so much. You guys literally are the, like, you guys literally brighten my day all the time. Like the messages you guys get me. I try to reply to everybody. If I don't reply to you, I'm sorry. Just send me another message and I'll try to get to it as much as possible. Usually if I see like a name that's frequent, I'll try to reply more often. Because I'll, I would have seen that you guys tried to contact me earlier. So that being said, we're going to find this place. Look how creepy this place gets. It gets creepier and creepier the more you walk. So most spotted this creepy rock structure. So we got a little bit sidetracked, so we're gonna go check that out and then we're gonna continue on our mission of finding this cave. Come on up, bro. So guys, we just made it up here. We're taking a look, taking a little breather, I guess, on top of this cool looking rock. 
Look at all that moss. We climbed all the way from down there. Now we're all the way up here. Take a break, then we continue looking for this cave. And if you guys want to see anything crazy, smash that like button. We'll do whatever you guys say, just we, for you guys. We bring the crazy. Exactly, we are crazy. My GPS says should be right here. Like literally, I should be standing on it. So it looks like we're gonna have to do some hunting for it. Me and Mo split up a bit. He's over there. I'm down here. Don't don't see anything though. Let me know if you guys see anything that uh, freaks you out or anything like that as I'm climbing, because you know it's good to know what you guys see. Are you guys yo? What? What the hell is that? Is that a rake? Bro, there's a rake here. A rake? That's so weird. Looks like the uh, wish used to rake stuff. All right guys, so we split up again. Mo said he found it, I heard him yelling. So I'm gonna start walking towards him now. I really hope, yo, I'm right here, where are you? You did? What? All right. Check this out guys. This thing is epic. Why is there a bench on top of it? I don't know. How are we Guys, gonna get in? Right through. Uh, huh. We're gonna figure out how to get in and we'll get back to you guys in a second. We'll get back to you guys. I just say Let's see how far in we can get. Maybe it's guys check it out. We found the cave. It's in there. Like I said, it's fenced off, but there's a hole. There's a hole in the fence. We're gonna go in there. We're gonna get you guys some cool ass footage. Hopefully it's not flooded. If it is, we'll come back later on in the summer. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Guys, we're going to the cave. Let's do this. This does, this does Ooh. look spooky. It, it looks does. really creepy in there. Oh, guys, especially so. guys, you never want to be in this position here. <laughs> Careful. Oh. Whew. Guys, Sergi's making his way in now. Okay. See that technique? <laughs> It's almost like you've broken out of cages before. Oh yeah, I mean, I was born in a cage, bro. <laughs> I'm a wild animal. Woo. Whoa, look at this place. Guys, we're here. That's so cool. Well, um, we were fed the wrong information. This cave is tiny as hell. What? Do you see that? Is that silver? It legit looks like silver. Is that silver? How about you guys, but that looks very shiny. It looks like silver to me. Look up there, that looks like silver. Ooh. So I guess we might just have to continue exploring this abandoned forest. Or exploring this forest. So guys, we just got out of the cave. We're gonna explore this forest. The website did say there were multiple caves in the area that connected. So we're gonna go find that. Guys, so it's that time of the video. We're gonna be doing shout outs. I'm gonna shout out four people from Snapchat, four people from Twitter, four people from Instagram, and four people from YouTube. So here we go. All right, guys, let's see. We're gonna open up a photo. There's me flexing. Now, who are we shouting out? Let us shout out. Oh, I saw a banana squad. All right, guys, let's see. Super Joshua, shout out to you for saying Banana Squad. 
Uh, let's see, Swag Sensei, shout out to you. Shout out to Bay7951, always flexing. Shout out to Dodd Phil, six pack alley H. Shout out to Carson, so savage. Hey, please do a 24 hour challenge in an elevator. Uh, we'll see, we'll see. All right, shout out to all these people here. Shout out to all of you. We're doing a massive shout out to all you guys because I love you guys so much. Except for this dude. This dude said stop flexing. No. I'm going to flex extra hard just because you said that. Now guys, let's do shout outs here. Shout out to Baybum7951. Oh, I think we just gave her a shout out. Shout out to, let's see, my story. Let's see. Shout out to Moriah Brook, Hannah BN4, number 106, Hey Bug. Mighty Mesh, T Gus, Nice Boys, Tacy Ka. Shout out to all these people here. Massive shout outs today. Shout out to all you guys. If you guys see your name, comment it below. Let me know. And now we're going to give a shout out on. Where are we going now? We just snapped. Let's do Twitter. Shout out to Lucas. Shout out to Rebecca. Shout out to Jordan. Shout out to Christopher. Shout out to Jimmy. Shout out to Kayvon. <sighs> shout out to Jennifer. Shout out to Knight and Jay. And now let's do some YouTube shout outs, guys. On my last video. All right. So let's see. Don't forget to like, comment on this video so you can get a shout out. Shout out to Sapphire 2012. Shout out to King Malik. Shout out to Asphon Vlogs. Shout out to Taz06. Shout out to Caitlin Roche. Shout out to The Weeknd. Shout out to Mr. Saiyan. Shout out to Tyler Lim. There are your shout outs. Tried to give you as many as I could. I love you all. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe below, and follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, and Twitter so you guys do get shout outs, behind the scenes footage. And like I said, I am giving away a copy of Fallout 4. To get that copy of Fallout 4 for Xbox One, share this video on Facebook, follow me on Instagram and Twitter, and then send me a DM showing me that you followed me on all those platforms, and then I will put you in the draw to win Fallout 4 for Xbox One. Guys, we're gonna die walking down this mountain. Look how bumpy this is dangerous all these rocks but we're doing it all for you guys part of the um, guys downhill walking down walking down this hill is no joke we literally have to like watch every single stuff we take because it's so steep we're like barely able to keep ourselves up we almost we both almost fell a few times like sliding down the hill at this point pretty much. But damn. Just wanna say I love you guys. You guys, Banana Squad is the hypest. Hey, you thirsty? That's gross. That's a lot. What do you mean? You would drink that? I would drink it if I had to. But I got a bottle of water. Oh guys, most spotted something above the hills when we were at the top and he thought he saw a structure when we were up there. Well, we kept going and you can see it right by Mo there. You can hear a few cars. So I guess I guess we're probably beside a road or something, but we're gonna head over to that structure right now and go check it out. Let's just hope nothing is in there that can kill us because we're not too fond of dying. I don't know if you guys realize, like, I don't like dying. All right guys, take a look at this place. Literally the ruins of what looks to be Somebody's house. Guys, this is terrifying. Look how spooky this is. Like, what is going on here? So, like, whoever used to live here had quite a bit of fun, I guess. Why is there a tree here? How massive that tree is. 
Hmm. All right, guys, so we may actually be turning this into a 24 hour challenge. We're gonna go try to find more caves, try to stay in those caves. Worst case scenario, we're gonna head back to the structure that we were just at and stay there for the 24 hour challenge. So stay tuned, we're gonna go exploring right now. Guys, look how scary this place is. This is literally the spookiest forest I've ever seen. Dude, I just found the car. What? What the fuck? Jackpot! Ow! Ow! Do not touch that plant! Dude, there's like thorn, little tiny thorn. Holy shit, that thing is sharp. Ooh, that thing hurts. Don't touch that. Okay, let's go around this. Guys, there's a car right there. Yo, this is so cool. I just found a car. We were meant to be here, bro. What the f? We were meant to be here. Guys, that's like an old mini coo. Like, is this an old beetle? No, it looks like a. That looks like a Bel Air or some shit like that. What the know. hell? Guys, how does that even get here? Better yet, is this quicksand? Yeah, why does that car look like it sank? So I'm currently standing in the trunk of an abandoned car that we had just found. This is insane. Like how the hell does a car like this get into like the amount of terrain that this car would have had to drive through is ridiculous to get here. I don't know, but I guess uh, this is probably one of the coolest things I've ever found. Like this is a classic car. We just found an abandoned car. It's like completely stripped. Looks ridiculously cool. Like it's a classic car. It looks like it's from like the like the fifties or whatever. Maybe even the forties, thirties, not thirties, forties, fifties, sixties. Completely like stripped down, like into the ground. Like it's being absorbed by the earth. The earth is literally decomposing this car. And we found a witch's structure. We think I think I hear Mo pissing. <laughs> and we found that weird structure and the mines. So this is getting pretty cool. Like this is some adventure, guys. Have a lot of form. This is where I saw on the snow here. This is where I saw something so looking for maybe we find some prints. Can you print this? What was that? What Yo, was that? what the fuck was that? What the heck was that? Dude, it sounded like a little gravel. Yeah. Hmm. What the fuck? Yo, I don't know if we should. I think we might be trespassing on like some animal's territory. Probably, but I want to see. Oh shit, this is quicksand. Maybe that's why that car sunk in. Hey, look, there's little, foot, there's little prints there on the snow. Guys, so, we're hearing. Yo, I think we should probably go back to the structure. Yeah. So guys, we heard like a growl of some sorts and we keep hearing branches breaking around us and we did hear something back there. Uh, we've decided that it's time to go back to that structure. That seems to be the safest place because at least we're, we're going to be confined around four walls so we can actually see what's going on around us versus being completely out in the open to any predators that are out here. Alright guys, so we made it back to the structure. Uh, this is where we're going to be sleeping tonight. It's going to be nice and cozy. Probably going to use Mo as a pillow at some point. Who knows? But man, we're tired. We did a lot of...
So I just want to say that was literally the worst sleep of my life. It was so uncomfortable in there. It was. And right beside a highway. But shout out to Most RG for finding this thing. We were able to stay here. We were completely unprepared too. We barely managed to get through the night with our supplies because we only like we were just gonna explore originally. Mm -hmm. So we barely pulled through. Thankfully, it didn't rain, yeah. didn't snow, was nice and dry. So he stayed up in his t-shirt all night. T-shirt life, bro. Yeah. I, I got told gloves. him I give him my sweater. Well, actually, I told him I'd sell him it, but <laughs> he didn't want it. <laughs> guys, I really, really hope you guys enjoyed that video. I want you guys to know that we appreciate you guys so much. We love you all. We love reading your comments. That being said, I want you guys to smash that like button. I want you guys to follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, and Twitter. Don't forget to check out Most RG's video. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to share this video so you guys can get into the Fallout 4 contest. I'll see you guys in the next one. Oh, you're still rolling? Oh, <laughs> hi guys. Hey, um, you guys want a close-up? Say that it feels right